Now, the Auditor General has cited the Youth Employment Agency of uncertified payment of 324 million cities to waste management company Zoom Lion under the Youth in Sanitation module. According to the audit report of district assemblies, the payment under the instruction of the executive director was done without documentation. The agency is also accused of increasing the management fee with Zoom Lion from 500 to 600 cities, covering 45,000 employees. We have a response from the Chief Executive Officer of the YEA, Justin Kodia. But first, my colleague Elton Broby joins me on phone with more from the audit findings. Elton, what can you tell us about these findings? So, Aisha, this is the audited account on the utilization of the Digital Assembly's Common Fund. So, under YEA, they have this sanitation model uh, contract with Zulam Ghana Limited. Now, there are three issues that the Auditor General uh, highlighted as impressions against the Youth Employment Agency. Uh, one is the upward adjustment of the management fee from 500 Ghana cities per person to 600 Ghana cities. Also, the recruitment of uh, the youth under the model, 45,000 of them, and the fact that the Auditor General says that he was unable to authenticate the uh, employment contract, and lastly, the payment of 324 million Ghana cities, uh, Zoom Lion Ghana Limited, which the auditor general says that he could not trade documentary evidence back him that particular payment. And once the administrator of the common fund stop further payment to Zoom Lion until uh, the youth employment agency is able to validate the payment, one, secondly, to provide employment contract uh, covering all the 45,000 individuals employed under the sanitation model and then thirdly, to justify the increment from 500 Ghana cities to 600 Ghana cities as management contract covering uh, the, the youth and sanitation model which the administrator pays to Zoom Lion as management fees uh, on an annual basis. Elton Brobe with the details from the Auditor General's report. Now, the YEA Chief Executive Officer, Justin Kodia, has a response. This document is the contract document between YEA and Zoom Lion Ghana Limited. And I can make a copy for you. You can have a view of the contract arrangement between us. And I quite remember the auditors came um, as to see us as part of their audit of the Sudas Family Common Fund and the contract document was given to them. So I'm very surprised if someone should say that he or she has not cited that document. And two, the issue about the 500 to 600. Um, bef before 2014, um, the amount that was paid per beneficiary for the sanitation model was 320 Ghana cities. And from 2014, it has been 500 Ghana cities, 100 cities to the beneficiaries, and 400 cities as management fees. So when we assume office administration in 2017, one, there was no proper documentation or contract between the YE and Sales uh, and Ghana Limited. So we wrote to Attorney General for advice whether there was a contract because we couldn't cite any formal document. and. The Attorney General advice was based on the conduct of the two parties where a person works and you pay the person. Then definitely there's a contract uh, between the two parties. But however, we should take steps to regularize the whole processes. And that is how this contract came about. During the discussions with, um, after going through the PPA and PPA giving us a green light to, to look at the amount that was being paid, someone was charging 500 cities from 2014 and we were in 2019. You take into consideration inflation, you take into consideration cost of items. Definitely, there was no way the 500 was going to hold. We needed to review it. But on the part of YE, we decided to do due diligence because in the past, it was placed that beneficiaries get 100 cities, the service provider gets 400 as management fee. But we were not comfortable with it. We thought that the amount that was being paid to the beneficiaries was hopefully inadequate. So we 
through discussion and negotiation, added 80 Ghana cities more to what the beneficiaries were, were getting to make it 180. Then the service provider had the 20 cities as additional uh, um, um, a negotiation bill uh, for them. So from 2014 to 2019, the only thing that had been added to the service provider is 20 cities per beneficiary. But however, too, we went further to state that when you talk about management fees, management fees is fake. We know there are logistics components and there's what you are charging as management fees. So let's break it down. How much are you going to charge as management fees? And how much is going to go into logistics? When you talk about logistics, it has to do with the uniform that the beneficiaries wear, the Wellington boots, um, the brooms, uh, the wheelbarrows, and you know after cleaning the road, there has to be a truck that will have to come and pick it, uh, moving it from the picking point to the dumping site. All these were factored in to, to, to constitute the logistics. It's also been speaking about the payment of 324 million cities to ZoomLion without supporting documents. And that one too, I'm, I'm really surprised because the last letter we received from the Auditor General, signed by what Mr. Samuel Boat Nasari, was confirmation of works, goods, and services paid for from District Assembly Common Fund. And I may read for the purposes sure. of that discussion, for our discussion. As part of the audit of the Office of the Administrator of District Assembly's Common Fund, a team from the audit service has been tasked to confirm execution of works and supply of goods and services to your assembly and related transactions. The verification will commence on Monday, 26 July 2021. Take note, Monday, 26 July 2021, and expected to be completed by 13th August 2021. Last Th week. That's last week, mm. 13th August. Mm. Please find attached a list of transactions, projects to be verified, and records required by the team for the exercise. Thank you in anticipation for your assistance to facilitate early completion of the assignment. Thank you, sign as I brought in Samuel Boatin Asari, Assistant Auditor General. And it has been copied to the Administrator, DACF, Chief Director, Ministry of Local Government, uh, Head of Service, LGSSI. And they made Executive Director, though I'm not Executive, I'm CEO, for why this is our copy. Then you go to the appendices. Yes, for YEA point, it says youth in sanitation model. Okay. One, what they want to find is the list of personnel, uh -huh. supply of logistics from 2019, monthly timesheet, quarterly reports, and other records maintained by the assembly concerning the execution of the contract. Uh -huh. So my question is, has this work been done? That's the question I want to find out from uh -huh. Auditor General. But as far as you are concerned, has this been done? Because when you've done it, what you have to do, you have to write a management letter sure. for us to respond. Uh -huh. But can they tell us they've written a management letter concerning their 19 July 2021 audit? Uh -huh. So nothing has been done? Nothing. We have not received any record. And per what you saw, uh -huh. the SI is supposed to be completed by 13th August. August. That was last week. Uh -huh. So at what point did they collate all this information, brought a management letter to YEA to respond? and for them to issue the auditor's report. So basically, these three issues that the auditor general raised uh, in the report, is it your understanding that you provided all the information or did you not follow up to get the information that has found itself in the final? Uh, maybe report? they will be the best people to answer because to the best of our knowledge, all the information that they needed was given to them. And it was based on that that they were supposed to carry the audit exercise from 26th July to 30th August, and I have not received any communicate from them. Yes, here that too, you could have asked for certain information we're not getting, but eventually you got them. And th those information is assisting you to further uh, go there and to check whether all those information that we have given to you is true or not. Aside that, um, you also have discussions between this office and the auditors. And it's, 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 it's probably not the best, but due to the circumstance, I think I also need to read the discussion between myself and uh, Mr. Sambo Boatin Asari. 
Um, good morning, sir. Please, we are preparing checklists for field verification of DACA payment, including your model. We, however, still do not have all the records we asked for. We are submitting a letter for the outstanding record, but we'll be grateful if you can ask your legal officer, take phone camera images of the appendices to your uh, first March 2019 and third June uh, 2019 addendum agreement and forward to us uh, extremely grateful. So for someone to state that forward to us appendices to your first March 2019, and third June 2019 addendum agreement, proof suffices that the person had the contract. And this was done? And this was done. And if you look at it, if you forward it. Okay. Yes, so if you look at it, this is how it's done. You see Ashanti region document, Greater Accra, BA, Eastern region, Northern region, Upper East, Voter region, um, up Upper West, Northern Red, all those documents were submitted okay. to them. So, if they are still asking questions, what possible conclusion can you come to uh, if all this information is provided by you? They are so well, uh, um, I think, um, like I indicated, I have not cited the report, mm. and it's a question that you have posed to me that I'm giving you a response. Okay. So, probably you can go back to them and let them know the information I've also given to which I've provided evidence of the, even the discussion between myself and the auditor. And I've also shown you the contract documents between us and them. And also referred to their 19 July 2021 letter, which they stated they were going to round to do an exercise, which would have ended in 13th August. So our question is, have they given us management letter with respect to the exercise uh, they, they went to date? 